My name is Shan Gosshorn. I'm Eastern Band Cherokee from Cherokee, North Carolina. And I am creating political baskets out of Arches watercolor paper. I print the image digitally with an Arches with um, archival inks. And I also use acrylic paint. So on this image, on this basket, this is a double weave basket, which means that in true Cherokee style, it's started in the interior. It's woven up to the desired height. The splints are turned, woven down, and they're finished on the bottom. So it's a seamless beginning and end. You can't tell where it starts or ends. But I'm using one of my own photographs here. It's a double exposed hand tinted black and white photograph that is printed on the Arches watercolor paper, cut into splints, and then woven into this basket. This basket is also combined with the uh, Indian Removal Act of 1830, which is what Andrew Jox Jackson illegally used to remove the southeastern tribes from um, that part of the country to Indian country, Oklahoma. So this is a photograph of a Cherokee woman in front of our ancestral homeland, the mountains of North Carolina. It's combined with this companion basket that shows an Indian woman in a buckskin dress. This is the top of her head, the bottom of her hair, her shoulders, and she's standing right here. She is standing with a typical Oklahoma landscape background, but this, this basket is also combined with the Indian Removal Act of 1830. This set represents the Trail of Tears. It represents our duality of belonging to two places at one time. Our, our desire to be established where we are now in Oklahoma, but also, also our in, innate birthright to belong in our homeland. What the...